Hello guys, you are welcome in your favorite channel Java Mitro. Most of the time we need to zip or unzip files or a folder containing files. So this is the first part where I will show you the requirement and steps to follow to make a zip file using Java program which can be unzipped by any of your favorite unzipper application. So basic requirements are that we need two packages to import. The java.util.zip package provides necessary classes for reading or writing zip and gzip file format. So the two important package we need to import are java.io package and java.util.zip package. Now we need some classes like file input stream to read a source file and file output stream to write content into target file. And the next one is zip entry which represents the next entry to write into the zip file. Now zip output stream class helps to write the content of zip entry into the target file. So let us go to see a small example to compress a single file. In this video I will show you how to compress a single file into zip file. So now the steps to follow is create file output stream object for output file, create file input stream object for the file to compress, create zip entry object to hold the file to be zipped, create zip output stream object to write the content into output file, set the zip entry to zip output stream object, then run a loop until you get minus one from read method and then write the content into zip output stream object. After finishing the loop just close all the three input and output stream object and that's all. So let us go. So first of all we need to import java.util.zip dot asterisk and import java dot io dot asterisk. Now create a class as zip demo and add a main method and since we are working with io so we just add a throws keyword to show that it can throw an exception. I am keeping source file as zipdemo.java that is my current open source file that is zipdemo.java. Now let us create a file object for source file, file input stream object and file file output stream object fs and give a name as target file as comp.zip and then create a zip entry to pass the name of file zip by calling get name method on this reference variable file. Now we need zip output stream and pass the file output stream object into its constructor. So hence we have zip output stream object. Now we need to add the zip entry into our zip output stream object so call zip output stream object dot put next entry and pass the entry object now we have added the entry into our zip output stream object so we need to a uh, loop before looping we have to create a buffer of some size i keep 1024 bytes put a variable as length run the loop it's not equal to minus one so until I get I receive minus one I will read the buffer size of data and if I do not receive minus one then I will write that buffer into our zip output stream object zero offset the length. Since the loop is finished, close all the input and output stream object. So here is our program finished. So let us do a compilation. The compilation is successful and now we can run the program. 
here we can see that our comp.zip file is available we can go to see that our comp file is here and we can unzip with the help of my winrar we can unzip out my zip file using winrar you can see and our zip demo.java file is inside our compressed file and we can also see the content it's same so that's all for today in the next video i will talk about how to zip or compress multiple files so thanks for watching and please do like share and subscribe to be in touch with your favorite channel java mitra and if possible please click the bell button so that you will be notified whenever i will upload any new video so thanks again thank you very much